Hello everybody, this is Kanda the Smart Home and my name is Ali Reza. In this video, I will show you how you can control your EVLink devices from Siri. It's very simple. All you have to do is create scenes on EVLink app, then add it to Siri. To clarify it, we will do it together. Before continuing the video, please click the subscribe button as it motivates me to upload more videos. By the way, I have created another YouTube channel. It's related to entertainment, fun, and sightseeing. It will be great if you subscribe it too. You can find its link in description. Let's start. Navigate to Evilink app. On Evilink app, at the bottom of the screen, tap on Scene. Tap on Plus to create automation, or let's say Scene. In if section, I tap on add. Select tap to perform. In then section, I tap on add to add actions. Select a smart device. Select NS panel. I set both channels of my NS panel to on. Do not forget to tap on save. Channel two on save. Save. Let's add another action. I tap on plus in then action, then action, select a smart device, select light. Choose on, tap on save. After adding actions, I tap on save. Set a name for your scene. Lights on. You can Set an icon for your scene by tapping on icon. Choose the icon you want, then tap on save. Scene is created. You see here at the top of the screen, on top of the created scene, we have add to Siri. I select it. We have lights on. In front of it, we have add to Siri. I tap on add to Siri. Done. The scene is added to Siri. Let's create another scene. I tap on plus in scene section. In F section, I tap on add, select, or choose tap to perform. In then section, I tap on add, select the smart devices, select light. I want to set it to off, then tap on save. Let's add another action. I tap on plus, select a smart device, choose an panel. I set both channels to off. Do not forget to tap on save. Okay, I tap on save. In this page, after adding actions, I tap on save at the top right corner of the screen. Set a name for the scene, leave home. Tap on save. Okay, again in scene page, you see we have add to Siri. I tap on it. As you see, lights on is added to Siri. In front of leave home, we have add to Siri. I tap on it. Invalid name. Please choose another name for this shortcut. Okay. I tap on record phrase to choose a phrase for leave home scene. I'm leaving home. Done. So far, I have created two scenes. One of them turns on the lights. The other set lights to off. Let's test them together. Before testing, I have to mention that I changed the name of lights on to turn on lights. Okay. Both channels of my NS panel are off. Light is off. Hey Siri. Turn on lights. Okay, done. 
You see, both channels of my NS panel are set to on and light is set to on. Hey Siri, I'm leaving home. After telling Sealy I'm leaving home, both relays of NS panel turned off and light was set to off. Okay, if you navigate to shortcuts of your iPhone, you will see that these two scenes are added to shortcuts. See, we have two scenes from Evelink app. You can delete them in shortcuts by tapping, for example, I want to delete turn on lights from the shortcut. I tap on it and hold it. Then I select delete, delete shortcut. It is removed. Let's navigate to Evelink app. Tap on add to Siri on scenes page. You see, turn on lights is not added to Siri. You can add it again by tapping on add to Siri. Done. Before ending this video, I thank Sapermona Work Group and Artman Company for supporting me to make this video. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't done already. You can support me by buying me a coffee. I'll see you in the next video.